price on anything. Secrets, reputations, a life. And trust? If you have to ask, you can't afford it. But then I suppose none of that matters when you're me. After all, when did I ever pay for anything? Alrighty, ladies and gents, boys and girls. Today we're tw testing a fantastic game. In my opinion, you know, the best game of its type. Uh, several years back, a game called Thief was released on next-gen and last-gen consoles. And it was, you know, it was quite a uh, successful game. You play um, Garrett, a thief. You skulk around in shadows. You, you steal... Uh, jewels and you take on missions as a thief uh pickpocketing completing side quests etc and the game is fantastic guys it focuses more on stealth gameplay than anything but you can knock out enemies drag their bodies into uh, hidden locations so that their colleagues don't find them and yeah the game was a pretty decent game and i loved it and uh it uses the Unreal Engine for the core gameplay, and the game seen here is running on the Xbox One X. Straight away, I can see a slight increase in texture resolution, and the game runs solid, guys. Now, obviously, the game is almost uh, knocking on the best part of four years old now, so I don't see there being a specific Xbox One X upgrade. <clears throat> but this is a game that I could tell you hands down now that I think if they used the mm -hmm. console properly, it could run easily uh, 4K uh, native at 60 frames per second. I would personally love yeah. to see this game. It's an old. <laughs> it's one of those old cult classic games, guys. Uh, it made its way from the PC, and it's a thinking man's stealth game, really, basically. Is rather fun to be honest. Here we go. Let's get that. Let's get that. So let me know in the comments what you think, uh, boys and girls. Is it a game worth revisiting by the the, 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 uh, <coughs> the developers? And is it one that you'd like to see if you got a One X? <coughs> Obviously, a lot of people bought this on the old Xbox One, so it runs without a hitch. All games are backwards compatible, guys. So if you got a One X. Uh, you'll play your old Xbox One games without any issues at all and it would also run uh, with much improved visual fidelity uh, uh, and improved frame rate your Xbox 360 Battles compatible games. I like what Microsoft have done basically. Similar to Sony's PS4 Pro, this is a, a, a gen refresh. And it is that bit more powerful than the Pro, which was already a powerful console, guys. So, you know, all in all, Microsoft now have the edge again. It is basically a reverse flip. PS4 dominated the X1 on hardware specs and uh, as such. And now, with the One X, Sony are playing catch-up to the more powerful hardware. So, anyway, let's continue with the game. You guys let me know what you think in the comments section. And yours truly, your boy, will uh, continue uploading more chapters if you guys like it. Like, subscribe, turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any of the amazing gameplay that we upload and stream daily. And thank you all for watching. You, you guys are fantastic. Thank you for the support, guys. All right, we're going to go out that window in a minute. Let's just make sure we've got everything. All right, so this is the very start of the game. So let's go out the window. I like the idea of being able to remain uh, in the rooftops and approach the gameplay from a variety of angles, guys. I could go along the street, along the rooftops, or take passages underground if I want. So yeah, all in all, a nice game. And as you can see, the game just run beautiful. All right, here we gotta be careful not to alert the beds too much. That painting's more my taste. I should All take right. a closer look. 
Now here, we use the elastic to feel across the top of the painting. And when we find the trigger button, the joystick will rumble. There we go, guys. Yep, there you go. Sorted. So let's pick the lock. Would you believe it? I spent a good few hours playing this game today, just getting to grips with it again, because it was a very long time ago that I last played it, and I thought, yeah, it'd be a nice, it'd be a nice title to stream. Oh, that's nice. Hello. Come here, gorgeous. Wow. What the? Oh, someone's up there. Blimey. Well, the rooftops at Thieves Highway. I just hope that's not who I think it is. Yep, it is who you think it is, mate. Trust me on that. All right, we've got to use our rope arrow now. So throughout the game, you get to use fire arrows, uh, water arrows that can extinguish uh, light torches so you, you can uh, get rid of the light. It's all about staying in the shadow, so yeah, you get a nice assortment of weapons. <clears throat> Alright, we got it. And the gameplay is really nice. And it still looks nice even today. Oh, hello. <clears throat> Ooh. Aaron. Of course it is. Aaron the cutie with the nice... Can make a little more noise next time? With the nice booty. How else would you know it was me? Basso did tell you we were working together on this, right? Well, I showed up, so what do you think? <laughs> <clears throat> I think you haven't changed a bit. Come on, it'll be just like old times. Alrighty, so here we go. Yeah, I did the first time, lovey. Alrighty, guys, let's play. Let's get moving. Let's get moving. Glad you could make it. Did you pick that route because it was fast or because he thought it'd be fun? Can it be both? Come on, let's get Basso his commission. All right, the light gem displayed in the lower left corner of the screen indicates whether or not you are hidden in shadows and dark areas. When the light gem is black, you are less likely to be spotted. So when it lights up, basically, guys, it means that we're well on the way to getting spotted. Now, we're running this test uh, gameplay on Xbox One X, the new console for Microsoft. And I'm just ascertaining uh, what has improved. Uh, so far, I can see, definitely see slightly improved, you know, more refined image quality. That's a given because uh, the raw power of the console, obviously, with a, f a far greater, in, you know, improvement on the GPU allows for much better uh, image refine quality and uh, this is not patched guys I repeat it's not patched it's it's a very old game are you going to use any of those shadows lady lamplight I was just scouting oh, let's just look at that ass guys Ooh. oh I was just about to sink my teeth and bite that and she moved damn it right if you do this now we could peek around corners like this I love that, thank you very much. You should get yourself one of these. See you on the other side. Looks like I won't be going that way. Let's finish unloading before summer's day is over. Why not drink to a job well done first? We, we can't just leave the cart out here. It's festival time. Your average thief will be under a table in an alehouse. And the watch will be liquored up too. I'm not haggling times with a drunk Yeah, thank you. I love that. Thank you very much. 
Right, obviously we've got to take an alternate route because we don't have the claw at the moment. Garrett, but we're gonna... On. We will get that later. Jealous of the claw? I made it myself. I'm sure the watch will be very impressed. They'll certainly hear us coming. They'll have to catch me first. Just be aware of your surroundings. It's not about taking in the sights, Garrett. It's about taking in the loot. <sighs> you do still steal, right? I've been stealing since before you could crawl. <sighs> There's the Garrett I know. How about a friendly wager? Let's see who can take in the most. Right, now the blackjack <clears throat> is the only tool I have to defend myself, so if I can attack people with it. And it's just a basic uh, tool by which I could smack people around the head and uh, knock switches and such. All right, let's get over here. So like I was saying, guys. I found. You and me out on the town? Why did we stop doing this again? Do you really need to ask? Yeah, he obviously doesn't like her attitude. She's too nonchalant, she's young, and she's uh, a little too cocky for his liking. She may be a nice girl underneath all that facade, but, uh, yeah. Anyway, let's, let's just loot everything. I'm going to be uploading a lot of these older games, just testing them out on my new toy, the One X. You know, just inter interesting to see... Uh, how well games run and and here's a nice uh, point of reference for anyone watching the video who has a 1x who's recently got it if you guys have got the disc version of Witcher 3 the game will apparently run up to 60 frames per second in most areas of the game that is uh, before you apply the updated patch which, which is around 18 to 20 gigabytes so yeah bear in note guys if you don't update it the game runs the, the uh, <clears throat> The game runs at 60 FPS in 900p mode. Apparently, when to keep a low profile in places where I'm not welcome, there's a lot yeah. of those places. Apparently, CD Projekt Red launched the Xbox One version with an unlocked frame rate, guys. So basically, what that means is the game will run up to 60 FPS, and it's not locked at 30. And um, I was kind of hoping that they would have allowed gamers like myself who like to run their games at 60 fps the option to keep it the 60 fps mode like a f performance mode or run the game at a, a far higher resolution and lock it at 30. oops right here we go guys we've got a lot picked so we just move the left stick and then when it rumbles we just hit the lrt button here we go two voila there is a lucky charm there. Here we go. Let's open the door. I haven't really seen many games like this since uh, um, I last played this, so it would be nice to see some, a return to form by the, the same developers or a Thief 2 or whatever. I like my stuff, kind of action stuff, adventure games. So yeah, I for one I would like to in this neighborhood. Would like to see an update. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. I thought this game was very well done, personally. And I've got this on PS4 Pro, so I'm going to run a comparison just to see how the two versions stuck up. And how this game uh, runs on the Pro with boost mode enabled. I wonder if the 1X has like a similar um, hardware facility like boost mode obviously give microsoft time guys uh the one x has been out now for approximately uh what since the seventh yeah so about two weeks just over and one of the biggest things i want to see update in the hardware is a similar function to allow me to record gameplay using the one x hardware uh dvr function up to an hour like i can with the uh ps4 pro let me know guys does anybody know possible to go beyond the limit of DVR functionality because I think that's just uh, some grade A BS now I've got the most powerful console I'm limited 
to record in five minutes with the hardware. I have to stream to Twitch and then upload to YouTube. And unlike the PS4, I can't just stream directly to YouTube, which is a rather annoying, bloody, uh, yeah, bloody annoying. All right. Did we come here? Yeah, we did. Okay, so let's get let's get out of here. If you're going to urinate in the street like a watchman, at least do it out of the light. Everybody can see you. <laughs> the ale has to go somewhere, <laughs> dear. The middleman. Besides, you're the only one watching. All right, let's uh, <clears throat> open the window. <laughs> come on, let's go try those gavel wings. And please remember, guys, to like and subscribe to Awesome Bob Gaming, my main YouTube channel. Turn on your notifications and drop those likes. Uh, the channel's the bomb, guys. It is awesome. It is uh, well uh, in that it is well presented and also has some of the slickest and you know most informative, funny, and downright superb commentary of any YouTube channel thus far on YouTube. In fact, for a smaller channel, it's up there with the big boys, guys, hands down. In fact, some of the, most of those big boys don't have a uh, can hold a candle to me. They're big, and they're just repetitive and <clears throat> not so. Uh, how shall I put it? There's no ingenuity. It's just uh, you know they do their videos. Good luck to them and all, but uh, yeah. So come on over, check me out. Give me any tips you'd like to see um, uh, included in the channel, and just help me develop the channel into something that is worthy of your subscription and thanks for watching really appreciate it alrighty guys here we are again how much did you steal? <laughs> it's not how much you steal it's what you steal and how you steal it looks like this primal stone thing that Basso wants is in the ceremony room at Northcrest Manor <sighs> it's the Baron's mansion Won't be easy. Worried? Yes, and so should you. I'll be fine. I'll pick up your slack. <sighs> this job's getting more complicated by the second. Alrighty, guys. <clears throat> We're off to the next chapter of the game. So far, so good. Erin, you could tell she's young. That's a lot of guards. They're definitely not here for the summer festival dance. A lot of guards means a lot of steel. Thieves and swords do not get on well. I've never had a problem with swords. But then again, I'm not just a thief. Alrighty, guys, here we are. We can't let the Baron's guests see this thing giving out. And we can't frigging see without it. Ah, they go off and on all the time. So you can't Ooh, excuse me, guys. I had to uh, run to the gentleman's the staff can keep up with toilet. His lordship's experiments. Not going to be much of a brighter future if the lights don't work. <laughs> All right. So we're looking to see if there's any treasure. No. Okay. No. Go down. Stay down. That's it. Now this bit's tricky, guys. If you do it wrong, you will get spotted. Hence, you will have to do the uh, level again. Oh, 
Oh, you can't. All right, so I obviously can't. Uh, doesn't it allow me the option to melee. All right, doesn't matter. Yeah, but once you pass this bit, guys, you'll be able to melee. Nick his pouch. Ronson, got it. Here, huh? Right, we've got his pouch. Help the new boy, will you? He's been trying to light a fire basket for ten minutes. What am I, his father? Go on before he sets fire to himself. <laughs> right now we have subst substances. <clears throat> substances. Sorry, got a bit of a cold. Like water, where we've got to go very slowly, otherwise we're going to alert the guard on the left there. Right, so the best way to do this, guys, I've found this to go there, and then duck down, and yep, here we go. Got that, and get the other coin as well. Right, let's get the water arrow, which is in there. Let's, let's equip the water arrow. <clears throat> equip. Come on, you stupid thing, equip. Alright, now it's equipped. Here we go. Right, now water arrows extinguish torches. Which obviously then allow us to sneak through the <clears throat> through the shadows. Right, sorted. Every time I get it going, it fizzles out again. You couldn't set a cloth of flame if it was doused in. Right, we nailed it that time, guys. Pack it together too close, then the air won't feed the flames. Uh, I should know better. My family used to be charcoal burners. Oh yeah? <laughs> That's work you don't <clears> see <throat> much since the factories came. Huh? Oh, come on. What? I need to take him down quickly before being alive. Alright, let's stash the body out of sight. Why'd you kill this guard? He was barely older than you. He was a guard, Garrett. Wrong place, wrong time. You haven't changed, have you? What's that supposed to mean? It means I don't kill without thought or good reason, and I don't get paid for it. So basically, it's okay when you do it, but not me. I see. I get it. But you know that guard? He's not gonna wake up later and follow our trail to cause trouble. When any guards wake up, I'm usually long gone. Now, guys, this game was published by Square Enix in 2014, so you can you can see there already over well over three years old. And it came out on PS3, PS4, 360, Xbox One, uh, Windows, and uh, yeah, it was a really good stealth game, single player stealth game, using the Unreal Engine. Alrighty, so he's pissed off at Erin because she killed the gods when she didn't need to. Alrighty, let's uh... Let's pick the lock. Right, if you hold down X, you can actually see through locks, so it's a nice point of reference to check the room before you go charging in and get your ass handed to you. If you're so eager to leave, maybe I should go first. <clears throat> Your
You're holding me back. Relying on that claw is holding you back. Yeah. She's a she's a cocky young ting. Uh, you could tell that uh, the my character, who's the uh, main character of the game, he's the more experienced of the two. Right, so here we grab a bottle, equip it. Come on, man, equip your bowl. Do as you're told. <clears throat> Come on, geezer, equip bottle. Stupid thing, equip bottle. Now the Xbox version also supports Connect, so if you guys have got a Connect, you can uh, you can distract guards with voice commands, etc. All right, here we go. Oh, no, Joker, don't climb. Distract. Yeah, here we go. Let's throw. there. Don't you just love it when a game f f throws a curveball at you like that? I mean, personally, I could have swore that um, I snuck up on him. That's just some grade A nonsense right there. What? What's going on? Who's making noise? You'd better right. stay hidden if you're messing with me. Perhaps I didn't hear anything. Now what? We don't even have to take him down. Let's just leave him for now. So come over here, guys. Grab the coins. And make it over here where we got to climb up onto the uh, the ledge here. Oh, ring the frigging bells! If you keep pacing up and down, you'll wear through those new boots. It's my girl, sir. She's presenting me to her father. He doesn't know I joined the watch. <laughs> and city watch means honor and respect. The thing is, sir, he believes that <clears throat> rat sack rumor about us being on the take. <laughs> Whoa, gang ho, babe. <sighs> she giving licks. You're She's dish I dishing out licks. <laughs> I share, probably. I'm worried you're gonna get us both killed. I can handle myself, okay? I can move faster, I can climb faster, I can... You can kill faster and make mistakes faster, I get it. You're not in control. Well, that's why I'm better. <laughs> Deal with it. Let's just get the job done. Has he not learned that you should never argue a point with a hot-headed young girl? She ain't gonna listen to reason. Oh, oh, we could grab. Oh, let's grab that. Come on, man. I wanted to copper fill. <laughs> Shame there wasn't the option to copper fill. Right, we've got her claw. And here we are, the first cutscene. Enjoy. I'm guessing that's what we're after, the primal stone. Robes. Robes are always a bad sign. Brothers Cornelius, Aldous, present the keys. 
Let's burn Northcrest. Brothers of the Awakened, we are gathered here to usher this city into a new age. One of progress and industrial enlightenment. Let us begin the channeling of the primal. Sembla and Strakakan. Scare Mama Kana. Come on. Let's go down there. This will be fun. No. We're done here. Job's over. What? Are you joking? Something's not right. It's too dangerous. And you're not ready yet. You know, I'm not a kid anymore. I can do this. I'm going down there with or without you. Not without this, you know. So while these two are fighting, those guys, those Illuminati cult guys are causing some sort of channeling disturbance. Oh, and she's falling down. Man, she's one fine bit of ass, mate. Don't drop it. Well, you ain't getting the put tonight. Come on, Garrett. Save her, man. Don't drop. Oh, he dropped her. Dang it. Well, mate, that wasn't smart. You dropped the only female bit of ass <laughs> alrighty so whoa damn the shit's just got real guys the shit's just got real I think the level of performance is pretty acceptable it's pretty nice so far Waking up. Come on. Stop slacking. We gotta get him in the city before they call the lockdown. Pace yourself, boy. We just need to get him to the clock tower. Safe and sound, and then we'll be rosy. Where's this car going? Baker's in Stone Market. <clears throat> Was I talking to you? Hey! Get moving! Fucking beggars. Makes you miss the old watch. So we've just woken up basically and these two beggars have apparently rescued me. Now here's an interesting facet guys, originally this game ran at 900p on the Xbox One and 1080p on the standard PS4 due to the obviously the PS4 being the stronger console. But I tell you what, the image quality still looks great and I believe what I'm seeing here is that the the One X obviously upscores and and does 16 times any isotropic filtering etc as standard to its powerful hardware. So yeah, the image quality is. I mean, look, you can see for yourselves it's looking great. Now, if it doesn't look good on the actual stream, that's because I uh, may need to change some settings on my Twitch. So bear with me, guys. I'm in the process of googling, finding out ways of improving my streams and thanks for your patience this is still a damn good game guys it's over three years old now oh that's unfortunate 
Oh well. A plague ridden city where people get hanged daily and value, uh, the value of life is literally worth nothing to these people. If you look this good on Xbox One, guys, just imagine how much better this game could look on this much uh, stronger hardware of the One X. It's not exactly an ugly looking game, I'll be honest. I'm at the clock tower, I'm clear my head. Alrighty, Don't guys, this is away. chapter one lockdown. So, I'm right what I'm gonna do, scum. I'm gonna stop this stream here, guys. It's, you know, uh, gone on for like 36 minutes. That's pretty long for part one and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stream part two in two minutes so please uh, tune back please subscribe if you enjoyed the video and gameplay which uh, I, I personally love this game it is a a game of a different nature the nature of the beast is you know combat mixed in with about 95% of, of it being stealth and running around in the shadows etc but it's a thinking man's action stealth uh, adventure game as such and to that effect it does it really well I haven't really played any games after this that have done it better so let me know in the comments guys can you recommend any similar sort of games and what other games would you like to see streamed on Microsoft's new beast 1x guys it's here it's in the flesh and so far I'm loving it it runs super cool super quiet and me personally i've not experienced any problems on my unit that effect guys i leave you i love you thank you so much for your support and make sure you subscribe and tune back for part two stream live in two minutes from now guys so until then guys thanks for watching god bless bye for now